But with that, you're all jumping, etc. Not just sitting and eating eggs. <laughs> so moving on to fats. Fats also have several important functions. I mean, besides giving mileage and uh, uh, being a source of energy, they have a lot of important functions. And one of the most important functions of fat in children is brain building. The brain is made up of Did you know that? No. <laughs> so I've heard a lot of people saying the brain is a muscle. So the brain is definitely not a muscle. It's not made of protein. It's made up essentially and primarily of fat. So they say na ghee kilao, bacha intelligent ho jayega. <laughs> not necessarily, but yes, the brain is made up of fat. Okay. So and fat is essential for brain and nerve health. Fats also have several other important functions. So you may go on giving the juices which are full of vitamin A, vitamin D, vitamin E, etc. But they are all transported in the body by fat. Okay? So in a fat deficient diet, a child will not be able to utilize all these excess vitamins which are pumped in through the juices, etc. And it's also providing essential fatty acids, which you can clearly make out in a deficient person. You will find that people who go on crash diets will suddenly have very bad skin. I'm sure you've noticed that. You know, suddenly they stop eating everything, you, it reflects on their faces. Because the fats maintain the skin with the essential fatty acids. So they have a lot of important functions, but it's again, <laughs> so the right is the key word. You need to eat the right fat. Okay, so the wrong fat can do a lot of harm. And the fats which come from plant sources are usually the best kind of fats. The fats which come from animal sources are not so good. 